Good morning, everybody. I know it's hard for you to see me washing the dishes because this thing's in the way. <laughs> but that's okay. I already made my coffee. to go out but I guess not. I'm talking about my puppy. supposed to be warm out today. That's come I haven't put on the heat at all. <laughs> we have a lot of sweater. No, no, no. Keep that off as much as possible. a little lunch for my grandson, the little one, only because he was saying that he wanted lunch. So I just made him like a half a tuna sandwich because he can't eat a whole tuna sandwich. It's just, it's just too much for him. So I said, I'll make you half a sandwich. So that's what I've been doing. That's what I've been making him. over to me later. There won't be any good by tomorrow.
She has a field trip coming up. This one's pretty quiet, so. <sighs> and it's pretty quiet, so I think I'm just gonna leave them out there for a little bit until he starts barking, and then I'll bring him in. So, top of the morning to you. <sighs> Sorry, it's cold. Okay. I'm gonna go check on him, and we'll see you in a bit. Might take a little bit longer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
do laundry. Shoot. Oh, it gets caught up up here. I do it too high. I want to wash this cover, but I don't know. I don't think I'll fit in the washing machine. Not the one downstairs. It's too big. I might have to take it to the laundry mat. And this, of course, is a scrubber puppy. He likes to lie down on here. these bags outside I grabbed them. I'm like, I don't care. They're from Walmart. I'm grabbing them. Actually, I think, I think my granddaughter probably grabbed more um, Walmart bags because they went to Walmart yesterday. And this could have been from her. <laughs> she said, I'll take them. <laughs> Okay, guys, we'll see you in a bit. Okay. So, I am making a beef stew right now. So, I started this about 11 o'clock. I already braised uh, um, the beef with oil, water. I already put the vegetables in it, onions and green pepper. 
and salt just to give it that you know good flavor now i won't put everything i won't put the seasonings in until maybe one o'clock then one o'clock i'll put the seasoning um the sugar um what else because i don't put the potatoes in until the last half hour oh and the cilantro because i don't want the cilantro to get lost in and wilted inside this so this has to cook for two hours it's already been cooking for let's see 12 like one hour already so i think i said 11 30 12 30 1 30 i think i lost track of time but i'll figure it out but it, it usually takes two hours to make and then at, at, again the last half hour that's when i'll make the rice so right now i have to go down and i don't know why my light went on but my light went on and i never put the light on so i don't know why it went. so right now i have to go downstairs i'm doing laundry right now comes the doggy <laughs> follow me down here. okay so I'm pretty sure this is not done yet I already took it out I just did one load I'll probably do another load oh yeah this is still wet oh my god look at that what the heck was this I don't know what that was so So oh, usually about two, it costs about, so this is two dollars and three, four. So it takes about four dollars to do the whole, to wash the whole load, which is still not bad. And it beats better than me going all the way to the laundromat. So it's all the way down, push that in. And this is the button that starts it. And Let's see where this little one's at. Let's see if we see him. Yeah, they have this other has to be painted wear and tear, of course. Wanna go outside? Hurry up. I'm gonna go outside for a little bit. Nice and sunny out. It's supposed to be in the 70s. I know. <laughs> I'm never gonna empty this. I get something has to give. Something. <laughs> uh, okay, so yeah, so I got I'm trying to time this. I started at eleven thirty. I know I started at eleven thirty at eleven o'clock. It took me a half an hour. So 12 30 11 30 12 30 11 12 30 it's 12 30 so one so by one o'clock i have to make the rice so hopefully by two o'clock everything should be done but i think i'm off a half an hour but i'm not sure but I'm pretty sure I started at 11. Everything started cooking down at 11.30. So it's already been one hour. So yeah. So at 1.30, at one o'clock, I had to start putting in all the potatoes. So yeah, the meat, the meat is still hard. So, okay, we're gonna let that finish and I'm gonna go. I don't even know what this doggy's doing. Cause the guy upstairs has to leave. And he usually leaves like, let me see if I can open this up. He leaves like at around a quarter to one. Where did he go? Oh, there you are. Are you done? Are you coming in? You gonna come in? Yeah? <laughs> he said, just open the door. <laughs> we'll see you in a bit. Hey guys. Um, so, 
Oh man, I gotta clean this table. Oh, God. Anyway, so just trying to get some laundry done. If you always see me when I'm down here, so I'm unfolding the unmentionables. <laughs> You guys don't need to see that. Okay. Um, so, yeah. Um, so, right now, I'm just... What was I watching? I was watching something. I don't know what the heck I was watching. I already watched Chickens by the Lake. Which was, was funny. Um, there's a reason why. <laughs> but you have to watch it <laughs> to find out. And what else was I watching this morning? I always like to watch things that are going to give me inspiration. Oh, I think it was about she was knitting some hats, which I'm still trying to, you know, I do want to learn how to knit hats. I see this one lady at um, at the school and she was selling like all these, these little children's hat sets, hats and scarves. It was really cute. I was like, how did she get into that? And I'm trying, I'm trying to learn how to so i could start doing them you know it takes time to uh it takes time to learn it oh chickens on the lake she was making um she was making bagels and i was like oh okay that's not you know nifty you know i never i never really tried to make bagels i mean i've made you know cakes and cookies things like that pies but I never tried to make bagels. I mean, hers didn't come out. I mean, they came out looking pretty good, and, you know, especially for her. Like, like she said, you know, it was almost like maybe it was her second time or her, I don't know how many times she's done it, but they came out looking pretty good. And uh, I was like, you know, like she said, you know, just, just got to keep trying until she gets better. Now, what else was I watching? I don't know what else I was watching. So, I don't know if I'll ever try my hand at bagels. I'd just rather buy them. A lot faster. A lot, lot faster. But, uh, yeah, just try and do uh, just one load. I didn't do that much uh, today. Plus, I'm making my beef stew uh, for, um, for dinner. Then I still got to make some more um, chicken soup for tomorrow. And I have to run to the store because I ran out of cilantro and I thought I had some. And I was like, wait, I could have sworn I had some, but I don't see it. Plus tissue paper, I don't have that neither. And I was like, oh, Jesus. Now you always have to run to the store. There's always, sometimes there's always something missing, like all the time. I mean, you, you know, you like constantly have to have a list all the time. Like, what? What am I missing today? <laughs> you know? But, um, oh, what was I watching? I was watching, um, the, the fall of, um, John Lennon's, uh, mansion. Man, that place was humongous. Like, it was really big. And to see how, you know, decayed it was and how destroyed it was. And um, it had a beautiful staircase. I mean, it was like, it was really nice. It's just a shame how, you know, people, scavengers and everything like that, they go in and they just destroy the place. Like, literally destroy it. Uh, but, um, yeah, it was, it was pretty nice. And nice and good to see. It's like, wow. A lot of stuff, a lot of books, a lot of chairs. But, but it was nifty to see. And now right now I'm going to be watching Joe, um, Mo Sargent, the Sargent family. So I'm going to be watching that next. Ah, so I already got the potatoes inside the... The beef stew because I sneeze in multiples like all the time. 
and my kids are and my grandkids are like one, two, and they're like and then finally when I'm done, then they say, God bless you. <laughs> they're kids, they're funny sometimes. They can be funny. I already got my two pumpkins, so I can't wait to start carving those. They're gonna be off like for about um two days. No, four days, Friday, Saturday, and and Sunday. So I figure I kind of like just want to wait, you know, because I don't want to do. I was going to do them Saturday, but I said, no, they weren't even here. So I'll just wait until we have all those days off and I'll we'll just make some cookies, decorate cookies, things like that. Carve the pumpkins, have a movie night, you know with popcorn, you know, just try to figure out a way to, to what do you call it? Don't want to bore them to death. <laughs> Cause you know, when you, when you're parents, that's one thing, but when you're a grandparent, you know, it's, it's, it's a whole different thing. They want to do things that you're not really into. And plus, um, and my grandson wants to watch, uh, what is that? That clock penny jeans are huge. See, I don't even, look, I don't even, my body swims in these things. I've been losing a lot of weight by my thighs. And I think I washed the wrong pair of pants or maybe I grabbed them and maybe I washed the wrong pair. I don't know. Cause I, I can't wear those. They're, they like so baggy by my thighs. I'll wear them, you know, like in the house, but that's about it. So, what was I talking about? I already forgot. But, um, yeah, so, you know, when it comes to, um, like, my grand, my older one, he likes uh, the FNAF, the FNAF um, series, or he reads the books, and now they're making um, a movie about it, uh, Nights, The Five Nights of Freddy. And so he's like really excited. Him and his mom, they're gonna go see it at the theater. The other kids are gonna watch it here when it comes out, when when it when it whenever it does come out. But um, yeah, they're, he's really looking forward to that. I mean, it's so cool because it's just like um, Chuck E. Cheese, and but they made it into like a, a monster movie. And the other one that came out too, and I think it's on. Hulu, I think, either Hulu or Disney, it's Goosebumps, they came out with Goosebumps, so that's going to be fun to watch too, so, yeah, I don't have a lot of laundry, just, I just just unload, not a lot, and mostly for the little ones, plus they're not even going to wear this stuff because they're going to be off for, they're going to be off for four days, so they're only going to need clothes like for three days and that's it, but I'd rather wash their school clothes and have them ready for the week after. Just so I don't have to worry about, oh, it's not washed or something gets done and I forgot. I might as well just get it out of the way, get it out of the way, have it ready. And then when Monday comes, you know, they're done. They're ready to, um, their school clothes are done. And so am I. So I'm going to go finish, I'm going to go shut off the potato. I'm going to give the potatoes maybe 10 more minutes for them to get soft. The meat is already falling apart. It's, it's like, I was already kind of like on cue. I was pretty good. I was probably, I, I kind of like maybe was off a half an hour, but I think, cause it should have been done at 1.30, but it was, it was at 11.30, 12.30, 1.30. So I was off like about a half an hour. So yeah, the, the meat is really soft. So I'm gonna put, these away. No matter what, I'm going to throw them in the basket. I'll put them away later. And I'm going to watch uh, the Sarge family. We'll see you in a bit.